As a stay-at-home dad over the years, I really enjoy um, cleaning the house and changing the bedding and hoovering the house, dusting. I, I love doing all those things. But um, at the start of November, I went down with COVID. My whole family did. Then I had a heart issue. I had a lung infection. Um, it's been kind of a rough month, and I haven't been able to do all the things I would regularly, normally do. One of the things I really enjoy is being clean shaven. And if you're looking at this picture thinking you're not very clean shaven now, there's a reason for that. And this is the video with a bit of that explanation. Do what you can when you can. One of the phrases I've shared is, it is what it is. Because at the moment, I'm not very well. My heart isn't working as it should. I'm on three types of medication to keep me from having a stroke and blood clots. I'm on medication to reduce my blood pressure, medication to drop my heart rate, which was the biggest initial problem. And I'm on all those medications and it's not a lot of fun, and it's quite limiting. However, I had a fantastic conversation with my local doctor, who, if I'm paraphrasing him, basically was rest for two weeks, as you've been told, and then get on with your life. Slowly, incrementally increasing what you're doing, but get on with living. Now, I like a clean-shaven face. I haven't got one. The reason I haven't got one is because my family were concerned that the greatest reason for most people on blood then is to go to hospital and need help is because they cut themselves shaving, and it's very hard to try and stop the bleeding. So I'm now growing a beard. I'm into my second week nearly, or the end of my second week nearly, in a couple of days, and I'm not really enjoying it. It's a bit scratchy and itchy, and um, I've been asking my friend Ben, what, what do you do with your beard? And now I've discovered there's this thing called beard oil, which I apparently need to buy to keep my oil, my oil in the beard, make it all soft and all that. It's kind of a journey, and it's a bit of a discovery, and I'm not really enjoying it. Last night I was going mad thinking I just want to scrape this rubbish off because it's itchy, and now it's passed. But do what you can, when you can. This morning, I was really tired. I stayed in bed. I just needed to rest. I don't like resting. If you know me at all, you know that I don't like resting. I like to be busy and doing things and helping people and cleaning the house and all that. And most of that's gone for now. It'll come back. I'll get there. But it's not there now. But I made the bed today and I was really chuffed with myself. It seems like a simple thing, but I made the bed. I put fresh bedding down for Joe and I. Last time I tried to tidy the bed, I had a cut on my hand, my first cut while on blood thinners, so I was a little bit wary and nervous. But in life, there are things that we can do for the people around us. Do you shy away and think, oh, I can't be bothered and I don't want to help them? Or do you push yourself forward and, and, and do what you can, when you can, to help others? I'm helping my family by growing a beard because the nervousness of me cutting myself shaving is real. So do what you can, when you can. Just a thought.